Right, we've just got a little update on the perfect panel jigs. When we made the original jigs, we found that 18mm panels advertised as 18mm. We're not in fact 18mm. So making them 18mm wide, for example, uh, they wouldn't go on some panels. Uh, so it wasn't really going to work. We made them a little bit bigger for the reason that then, you know, they will go on. It did just mean that you have to hold it in place whilst you're kind of holding your panel in place, etc, etc. Uh, made it a bit more difficult. So what I've got now is the new Perfect Panel Jigs. Now these have got tapered internal sides. So they will grip onto your panel. As you can hear, they're pretty tight. This panel is actually 18.5mm. Um, so it, it is very tight on this one, as you can see. So they will hold on well to these. The other thing we've done is we've now got the bronze scribing block. Now I'll show you this in a minute. It's got a built-in pencil sharpener. You can either leave that in there, take your pencil out and sharpen it. It is a snug fit, it won't fall out. Um, or you can just take that out, sharpen your pencil like that. Push it through a bit more and then I can show you. See the pencil's a tight fit in here as well. There we go. And you can just, it's better than using a knife because use a knife, the point of your pencil is not in the center of the pencil. As you can see, very, very sharp, that one. Okay, right. Now the way that is used, have a look what panel you've got. 18 mil, 18 mil panel jig, depth, here we've got 18 mil door, two mil buffers, so we want 20 mil overhang. So 18 mil, 20 mil. Get another jig, doesn't have to be the same width, but for the purposes of it holding on, we'll use the same width. Put that on the top, okay? Push them against each other like that. Yeah. This is our makeshift wall, this plasterboard. This is our cabinet. Hold it up against there. And clamp this on. Flush with the top in this case. Because this is, if you like, a mid-run panel. So, it will be flush with the top of the cabinet, flush with the bottom of the cabinet. Okay, get that to where you want it. Now on the front edge here, I'll just show you. That's how it wants to be, okay? When you've got that like that, the width we need to get rid of is in the scribing distance, is the width of this jig here. That'll then give you the perfect overhang as determined by this jig. So this jig here, the bronze scribing jig, the edge of that to the center of the pencil is exactly the same width as all of these jigs. So you can use any of these jigs as, as this spacer. It doesn't have to be that one, you can use any of them. Okay, so back of the cabinet down here, against your wall, let's make sure they're actually up against the wall here. Okay, yeah, get your scribing jig. Like that. And then we're going to scribe that now. <laughs> 